So Circuit Check provides manual, pneumatic, and vacuum actuated fixtures, as well as inline test fixtures to OEMs, and contract manufacturers worldwide. What is an in-circuit test fixture? It's pretty simple. The components are soldered to the circuit board. And at the end of the line, the circuit board comes off and goes onto an in-circuit fixture. What we do is we test those components on that printed circuit board as they are located in that circuit. It's important to make sure that we have the components soldered in the correct orientation and they have electrical connection. So Circuit Tech has about 40 years in the industry of building in circuit fixtures. And over that course of time, we really drove the use of 50 mil probes in the early 80s. So the 50 mils really drove us to dual-sided fixturing, which means probing top and bottom. And once we got into the high density fixtures like that, the issues popped up of coplanarity. We kind of invented the dual-sided pneumatic fixture. And right beyond that, we had to come up with bi-level fixturing to use two different levels of probes to contact the circuit board. And as time went on, in the 90s, circuit boards became huge with thousands and thousands of components, which required thousands of probes contacting the thousands of wires. So our solution to that was to come up with a wireless circuit board that took the place of all those wires. And so we have a single circuit board now contacting and interfacing with the tester, and it's worked out beautifully. In-circuit test really evolves around testing that circuit board as it comes off the manufacturing line. So ICT test is placed right after the solder machine. And so now we want to test for the mechanical assembly of the circuit board and the electrical integrity of that circuit board at the same time. And so the factory can't manufacture boards without our test equipment.